Hey everyone, welcome back to the Living Laster Style channel. Um, as you know, today is Valentine's Day and my sweetie poo is sick today. So um, I literally have been with Cam all day today. We've been at the doctor's and, you know, just um, taking care of my man today. So with that being said, I want to say happy Valentine's Day to everyone. I hope you spent time with your loved one. And if you don't have a loved one at this time, self-love is amazing and you wait for your special person. So with that being said, I am like starving. Um, we left the house this morning, had doctor's appointments, and then um, we've been out all day. So um, if you are new to our channel, welcome. We hope you subscribe to our channel and be part of our Cold Chili family. To all of our Cold Chili family, um, I want to say thank you so much for always supporting us, always being there. And um, Cam and I kind of like discussed it, and it was this was something that we really wanted to do together. Um, however, since Cam is ill, we wanted to give shouts out to one of our Cold Chili families, someone that has supported us from day one. And we're giving a giveaway today. We wanted to do that when we reached 300, but we wanted to give a giveaway today to one of our most amazing, our most honorable, our most, one of the co chilies that has always been here for us, Lisa Lewis. We absolutely love you. We want to thank you for being here for us through our journey. We thank you for your support. And you have a gift coming to us. So I will reach out to you shortly after this video. And I want to hook up with you so I can send you your amazing gift. Because we love you so much. And we thank you so much for supporting us through the years from our wedding until now. So thank you so much for everything that you have done. Lisa Lewis it is very, very appreciative. And we thank you for being part of the Cold Chili family. So, with that being said, again, happy Valentine's Day, you guys. Um, I'm starving! So, with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and show you what I'm getting ready to eat today because I am so hungry. You guys know that I absolutely love seafood. So, here is my meal. Um, I have corn. I have mussels. I have shrimp. I have king crab legs. Um, I also have a lobster tail. I didn't want to make a lot of food today because it's getting really late and I'm just starving and I want to eat something. So here's my food. And there you see, I'm so excited. I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. <clears throat> and this is going to be a Valentine's, um, our first date chit chat, um, video today. I also made our um, sauce. Um, I'll tell you, I know there is a lot of sauces out there and I give homage to everyone who um, came up with amazing sauces. For me, I make my sauce, I put all the seasonings that, that I like in it, I taste it and I taste it and I add and I add and I taste it and I taste it and I add. So um, that's how I make my sauce. So. We're going to get into this. I'm going to say my, my uh, grace and we're going to get to eating. Heavenly Father, I thank you for everything that you do for us, Heavenly Father. I thank you for another blessed day. Just another day to see, um, just another day and to make it right from yesterday. I thank you for all the journeys that you put me through, all your blessings that you have um, bestowed upon myself and Cam and our family. I thank you for being bringing Cam into my life, the love of my life, um, just everything, Heavenly Father. Um, sometimes I don't have the right words, but you know my heart, Heavenly Father. Um, I thank you for the change that you are making within my life right now and this journey through YouTube, the journey that I'm going through within life right now. And I thank you for everything, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' name, I thank you. Amen. So let's get going with this mukbang. 
hungry y'all so i'm gonna go ahead and get my food over here so i can start eating um i have water today no beer no liquor no nothing just water and i have my little paper towels here i have my special sauce here and um yeah let's get going because i'm starving um i'm gonna start with this piece of corn because it's like sitting right on top and we're just gonna have some conversations and I just thought about today, since today is Valentine's Day, um, I just want to let you guys, what was so funny today for Valentine's Day, Cam and I actually took off work, and we were just going to spend Valentine's Day together, which is our 23rd, 22nd Valentine's Day together, and hold on, let me bite this corn. Mm. Mm. Hold on a minute. One more bite. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, <clears throat> it's spicy. The lemons just like bite you. Mm. Oh, God, it's so good. Ooh, got what I was saying, Lord. Oh, what was I saying? So. It's Valentine's Day, and yeah, we took off today to spend time together on Valentine's Day and just celebrate each other's love, and just celebrate our love, and mm. sorry, y'all, I couldn't put this, this, this corn down. Mm. Sweet and salty is always good. Um, so yeah, so we took off work today and I'm going to eat a, um, I'm going to eat a, um, shrimp, you guys. We took off work today, um, to spend time together and, um, when I got home from work, um, Wednesday night, Cam didn't have to actually, um, work. So Cam made me this amazing dinner and I came home and I was so excited we ate dinner together. And the dinner was freaking amazing. I was hungry. And we just sat down to talk and we chilled. And um, as couples, you, um, you don't want to alarm your other half when there's an issue going on. And Cam didn't feel well and failed to tell me because Cam wanted my Valentine's Day to be um, enjoyable and didn't want to worry me. Because Cam know I'll go into worry mode in a minute. <clears throat> and so I enjoyed my meal. We went upstairs for bed. And I came downstairs this morning to my beautiful balloon. Let me show you my balloon. This beautiful balloon. And the bottom is so freaking cute. Right, y'all? And so, and then, if you look in the background, I have 12 dozen of roses back there. And I got the bracelet that I love. I love, um, um, what is it? Annie? It's like an Annie bracelet. Um, I got the I Love You bracelet. Um, from Annie and I forget the name y'all. I remember. I'm sorry. Can't remember right now, but I got the bracelet that I wanted and then Camille knows that Cam knows that I'm always cold and Cam is always hot. We are so like cold hot. Just we're just like so different, but it works. And so Cam brought me this beautiful Valentine's Day throw with a pillow that has a heart, but it lights up. So it's so freaking cute. And then Cam got me a card. Cam knows how I love cards. I absolutely love cards. Um, when you send me a card, I will keep it forever. Um, I have every card that anybody has ever gave me, I kept. And so this card that Cam gave me was so special for Valentine's Day. It had, when I opened it, it had like this many coupons and like for a date 
for a back rub. Oh my God, my camera's slipping, you guys. I'm sorry. Um, um, a camera to do, I mean, a coupon for this, a coupon to get a back rub, a foot massage. And then there was a coupon just for what I wanted, something special. I just love when somebody gives me a card that means a lot. So Cam gave me a card. It's absolutely amazing. It meant so much to me. And yeah. And so um, we, Cam finally told me because Cam couldn't, had to tell me because of whatever was going on. Baby, I, I really don't feel good. And I'm sorry. And this is, this is, this is, this. I'm like, oh, on the phone with the doctor. And so... We've been at the doctor all day today. And, you know, <clears throat> at the end of the day, um, I need for Cam to be okay because I need my other half. And we love each other and I want Cam to be okay. So, um, that's what we did all day. So, it got me to thinking about our first date. <laughs> and I wanted to share it. Um, so... Our first date, um, I'm going to tell y'all what I had on. So, I had on this pretty velvet two-piece. Yes, velvet. It was green velvet with some brown lines in it, but it was slick. And I'm going to eat some muscle, y'all. So, we were planning to for me to pick up Cam because Cam didn't have a car. And so... Mm. So, so I pick him up and <clears throat> I got scared. It was my first same sex um date. I was freaking scared. So mm. and so Cam was like happy dappy happy. <laughs> and I was like scared. But Cam had planned for us to go bowling. And at that time, we had beepers. Um, so, um, the moment Cam actually walked out of the house, I was, like, scared at that point. So, I was kind of thinking in my mind how to get out of the date. And so, Cam had planned for us to go bowling because Cam thought it would break the ice. And so... I was trying to figure out how to get out of the day because I was freaking scared. When I tell you guys, I was so freaking scared. Um, I knew what I wanted, but I was scared to like step into it and be myself. But I was scared. You have to remember back in the days, um, at this point, I already had three kids. I was scared. Um, I had been like, Wanting to do this forever and be with um, a woman because that's what I wanted. But I was scared because of society. I was scared for my what my parents would say. I was scared what everybody would say. And so with that being said, I um, went on this date secretly. And if you go back to the video, um, and I don't kind of link it to our 22nd year anniversary um, video, it actually tells you, um, you know, all of that, um, and how we met and all of that, if you want to go back and look at it, but yeah, I was scared, I was scared, and I was trying my best to figure out how to get out the date, uh, I was secretly, um, since I had kids, um, I took my pager and I started like turning it off and turning it on and talk, turning it off and turning it on, which actually it makes the beeping noise. So it's like somebody's beeping you. So I was like, oh my God. Um, I'd love to, but I can't do that yet. <laughs> that's our refrigerator, you guys. And so I was like scared just trying to get out the date and... Um, I kept turning myself, my, my pager off and on and off and on. And I was like, something's going on in my home. Let me check on it. So basically I said, there's an emergency. I need to stop the date and I need to go home. Cause I was trying to get out the date cause I was scared. I was scared y'all. 
But yeah, so Karen was like, well, okay. And so um Kim was like, You sure you want to go bowling? That was before we was trying to, we had got to the bowling. We had got to bowling. And I was like, I'm so sorry, but I really need to go home. So Cam being a gentleman and said, Okay, I'll take we can go home. And so we um Cam was like, but can I at least buy you dinner before I take you home? So we, if you're in Milwaukee, remember Judy's on Lisbon's? I know they're still open, but anyway, I was like, well, okay. And then I have to go home. I really have to go home. So we went to Judy's and we got Italian beefs. And then um, I dropped Cam off back home and um, got my Italian beef. And we sat in the car for about two minutes to eat. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, guys. That's so good. <laughs> and so we sat in the car for a couple minutes to eat. And I was still scared as crap. And I said, I really have to go. So, um, I got out of the car and left. And I got home and I was freaking scared. I'm mess it up. It's so good. Ooh, I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. Oh my God. Oh. Oh, Jesus. That's so good. Mm. Tell me, y'all, seafood. Woo, it takes you to a place, I tell you. But anyway. I'm going to that shit now. And so finally, Cam went home and I went home. And I was so scared. I was like, you know what? I can't do this. I decided I didn't want to see Cam anymore because I was scared. And so, remember that we actually had built a relationship over the phone for like three weeks. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. mm. Y'all just don't know. Mm. Mm. So good. And so we built this relationship over like a mind relationship where we really like fell in love mentally. And so, um, ooh, that crab leg, my God. Um, so we fell in love mentally. I'm move the camera a little bit, y'all. And I actually started missing Cam. Um, oh, let me finish. After I got home, Cam started call calling. I refused to take the call. And then Cam had um his best friend calling me and I answered the phone and I was like yes um Cam wants to know are you gonna um get with him again and I was like no tell your friend don't ever call me again I, I I don't know I'm scared I don't wanna do it and I told I told her don't call my house no more and so um with that being said Cam didn't call me anymore we didn't speak and I truly started missing Cam. Getting the rest of this crap leg, y'all. I should have made the other one, too. I don't know. Mmm. My God. That's good. And so, um, I started missing Cam. It's like when you mentally fall in love with somebody, it's like, um, it's the same as being in love. Um, and then after about two weeks, um, I called Cam and I was like, I really miss you. And um, we started back talking again. And 
we just told each other, you know, that we wanted to be together. And we went through whatever obstacles that went in our way. I mean, because... It, oh, look at y'all. Look at that. And um, after that, it was just... When we decided what we wanted, and I introduced Cam to my to my kids at the time, our kids now, that was it. Um, it's been us, Cam, myself, and the kids. It's been us, and now we got grandkids, and you know, it's it's just us now. So I can't wait to eat this. Mm. Oh, God. Y'all, it's just something about seafood. It's just like... Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, that's so good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm like, that's it, y'all. Mm. And so, yeah. It's my corn now, too. Uh, maybe I'll just put everything in the little juices. Yeah, let's put everything in there. And so, I'll tell y'all. When you love somebody with everything and they love you the same way, mm, it's amazing. And it's like we will go to the end of the earth for each other. It's going to be so good, y'all. Um, and so we actually are in our 23rd. This year be 23 years together. And so we, um, hold on, y'all. I gotta eat. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, that's so good. Mm. Now, this is the one thing Cam and I don't share. Cam don't like seafood. <laughs> mm. Not at all. When I cook seafood, Cam be like, oh, the house smell like mukbang. <laughs> mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. And so that was our first date story. Um I basically told Cam that that I was uncomfortable and I want us to be able to be comfortable around each other. I want to have a relationship. And um, and so what we basically did was um, we started spending time together. And once I was comfortable, um, get the camera here right, y'all. Once I was comfortable, um, we started spending time together, more time together. And um, then I introduced kid, uh, Cam to the kids. And they started like spending the night with Cam and going to the zoo and just doing type of all type of functions and just getting to know Cam on a one-on-one -on -one basis. And then after that, we kind of mingled together. And that's how we brought our family together. 
And I'll say um, the baby at that time was four years old, and now he's 26 or 27. He's 26. Oh, my camera is doing funky stuff, gal. Okay. Okay. So, like, for Father's Day, I want the rest of that uh, uh, lobster, y'all. So, for Father's Day, they celebrate um, Father's Day for Cam. Mm. Mm -mm. Oh, that's good. Mm. Oh, man. I'm telling y'all, seafood is the bomb. So, for Father's Day, they celebrate Father's Day for camp. Um,. Mm. I'm sorry, y'all. I got quiet. So good. And now we have a grandbaby. And family is like everything to us, so... And um, it's like I think that lesbian couples, um, a lot of lesbian companies, like the younger ones, they get a lot of uh, bad feedback. Like all they want to do is party and have sex and stuff. And I just hate there's so much bad feedback about that because it's not like that. Um, I mean, we're, we have relationships. We have homes. We have cars. We build relationships um, as far as we have work. It's just like heterosexuals. So, but yeah, I just want this to be about a love video, but yeah. But let me tell you guys, um, we're working on 23 years this year come October. We're excited. We're gonna review our we're gonna renew our vows on our 25th. So I'm super excited about that. I love weddings, so I'm excited about that. But um I just want to come to you and just like talk to you because I even though this is a day of love, my other half is under the weather, and we just want to let you guys know that we appreciate you for uh, being part of our channel. Thank you for so much support. And I done got full, so um, <laughs> I think I'm going to go take my happy butt to Sleepy Town. So, if you're new and you watched our videos for the first time, please subscribe to our channel and be part of our family. Um, today is the day of love. We hope you are enjoying your other half. And thank you so much for always watching our videos and support. And I hope you're having an amazing evening. Goodbye, see you on the next.